tot allò que es vagi acordant. En les que podem llegar a un acord de manera. After weeks of discussions and still some details to be ironed out, the Spanish and Catalan governments will officially begin bilateral talks aimed at resolving the political deadlock next week. This is Catalan News in 100 seconds. The negotiation table between the Spanish and Catalan governments will get underway next Wednesday. Kim Torra met with Vice President Pere Aragonés today to discuss the dialogue talks, with some details yet to be decided, such as who exactly will form part of the Catalan side and whether or not there will be a mediator. Entenem que és una figura necessària per garantir l'èxit precisament de, de tot allò que es vagi acordant en aquesta, en aquesta taula de negociació. Lo más importante es que hablemos en primer lugar de las cosas en las que podemos llegar a un acuerdo de manera mucho más fácil. Jailed pro-independence leader Kim Forn left prison today after being granted daytime leave. Spanish prosecutors have threatened to bring the pro-independence leader's use of the constitutional article to the Supreme Court, arguing they are covertly enjoying the leniency of lower-grade inmates. The lawyer of Supreme Court judge Pablo Llarena, who ordered arrest warrants against exiled Catalan leaders, accused Carlos Puigdemont of exporting the conflicts to Belgium in this morning's preliminary hearing for a case in the Belgian courts. Puigdemont and fellow exiled MEP Tony Comín filed the case against Yarena for an alleged violation of their right to a fair trial. Això ens va obrir una porta a fer aquesta demanda davant de la justícia civil belga. Efectivament que ens defensarem. Això no és oportunisme, això és defensar els nostres drets. A new government program aims to improve the authorities' response to natural disasters, including informing citizens better on what the government can do to help them and simplifying the procedures in applying for aid. Catalan exports beat record figures for a ninth year in a row last year, as sales abroad amounted to more than 73 billion euros, up around 3% on the previous year.